I've been daily driving my Mazda RX-8 for over two years, so what is it like to have it as an everyday commuter car? It's actually pretty great. The suicide doors are great for throwing a bag, instrument, or anything else into the back seat. I put everything from a guitar to a set of four wheels to three people in the back seat. It is very convenient and quick to put stuff there and then grab it and go. Carrying stuff really isn't too much of a problem either. The center part of the back seats go down and allow access to the trunk just like any other car. I've carried four 10 foot long pieces of conduit in my car without even needing to open the passenger side window. Now let's get down to how it drives. It's so much fun in any condition, as long as you don't get on the gas too much coming out of a corner in wet or snowy conditions. It drives great in anything. I've daily driven this car in the snow, including on the freeway in the snow, and it handles great. It is always a great stress reliever after a hard day to get on the gas and let her rip. So now that you're convinced the RX-8 is a great commuter car, here's its drawbacks. The gas consumption, obviously. I get around 11 miles per gallon just driving around town, occasionally rip it around, you know, it's fun. But when I get on the highway and I try to save gas, I'm still only getting about 21 miles per gallon. You don't buy a sports car for good gas consumption. You buy one to have fun. The price of gas is just the price you have to pay to have a good time on your everyday drive. The other reason an RX-8 may not be a great daily driver is if your commute is very far. The 13V Ren Assist does not last too long, and you see a lot of drivers abuse their cars and complain why it blows up at 80,000 miles. Because of the design of the rotary, the apex seals can fail and you can lose compression, so they will usually not last as long as a piston engine. There are ways of prolonging your engine life, and the easiest way is to keep up to date with your maintenance and keep an eye on your temperatures. I only drive a couple miles per day, so I'm not too worried about my engine blowing up anytime soon. My engine was also rebuilt 10,000 miles ago by Mazda under warranty from the previous owner, so my engine's in pretty good shape. If you do drive a lot every day, you may want to think about if you really want this car as your commuter. The RX-8 may not be fast, but it's a ton of fun, and driving it every day just makes every day that much more enjoyable. So, if you want to see more RX-8 videos, you can check them out on my channel, and be sure to subscribe. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one.